rest of the old world are here, so we must learn with the best. Keynote speech on uh, Monday morning was very interesting. It was a gentleman that was presenting on the demography and the population growth and so on. Very, very ch interesting, yes. And I hope, truly hope, that this Congress inspires everyone and inspire them to continue to be an inspiration for us all. And thank you so much for, for having me here. It's, you don't get this information. You can read journals and so on, do online research, but it's really better to be here live and see it in person than to, than to sit up late at night reading uh, online publications. We, we think that um, when we, by the, we, the two years we have to get to Australia are enough for us to now pursue the undertakings that will be, will be made here. Um, and, and, and I think it's, you know, I'm looking forward that um, by that time our, our cities will have made some progress. There is a lot of exposure to various aspects of the water sector regulation, like I've said, technical solutions that are being brought up, new innov innovations that other people are doing, and uh, for instance, managing their assets. And uh, so there's just a lot to learn. And uh, anybody who can make it should make it to Brisbane. Yeah. So we have been talking about uh, the mission and vision of IWA for the coming year 2030. So everything has been strategically lined up for that. And then in two years' time, I would like to see personally how young water professional could contribute to achieving that together with IWA. So I think in Brisbane, we would have like a solid foundation on what kind of contribution that the YWP could make to the water sector. We look forward to showcasing what we've done to the rest of the world, and we also look forward to learning from the rest of the world. So I hope you all come and see us in Brisbane.